But the very same day Dream uploaded that video, another drama was unfolding. Something completely different, and if not dealt with carefully, could completely destroy Dream's career. This is by far one of the biggest dramas that would define his career. And ladies and gentlemen, this is where it starts getting bumpy for Dream. Dream was just caught cheating in a Minecraft speedrun. Quote unquote, too unlikely to be real, and they're essentially saying he cheated at it because there's no way that he could have possibly pulled and it off. And on the 12th of December, one of his Minecraft speedruns was removed from the leaderboards under the assumption that it was achieved while cheating. So where do I start part 2? I guess this is a good place to start it. After Dream uploaded his video called Stands, where he pretty much defended his stands the entire video, the very same day that that video was uploaded, a YouTuber known as GeoSquare made a video exposing Dream for faking his speedruns. In the video, he used a lot of math to prove that Dream, Dream is a little cheater. The whole drama started way before the entire video, where Dream and the speedrunning website just got in a giant argument, but who cares about that? Now the thing about this drama is it had a bunch to do with math. Yeah, who the f*** likes math? Everyone is pissed off, and rightfully so, that's like going to McDonald's and buying a 10-piece chicken nuggets and getting 9. They cheated you! Sorry, I shouldn't trauma dump you like that. So considering a lot of people were against Dream at this point, Dream had to respond. So that's exactly what he did. Dream uploaded a 25 minute video defending himself from all the sins he was accused of. And to put it simply, just more <laughs> math. But the thing that separated this from just a normal response video, he hired Bill Nye the Science Guy. I'm a science guy! And after the video, no one really knew who to believe because no one's actually a f***ing nerd. Guess what? Dream's growing even faster. Yeah, I don't f***ing know how, but he managed to grow to 10 million subscribers, 15 million- he He's just a big YouTuber, okay? But as I said in my last video, when you grow really big, you always are under threat of scams. And as he's growing bigger and stronger, He's getting more and more of these stands, and to put it lightly, they're growing a lot more softer. These stands went up to Dream and said, Hey Dad, uh, George hurt my feelings. Which then usually George would apologize for the very minuscule thing that he decided to do. Guess what? Dream has finally devoted his channel to one thing. And that's no more essay commentary, but now he's just a gaming channel that just makes videos on Manhunt, with the occasional misfit video. Minecraft Manhunt is a series that Dream made and has paid off so much, with him averaging 15 million views per video. That's absolutely insane. That's Mr. Beast levels. Dream's channel is far from dying, and he seems to only be growing. He's also friends with a bunch of other creators who are over 10 million subscribers like Mr. Beast, etc. He made it clear that Dream is no longer a smully. He is no longer that YouTube channel with 100,000 subscribers. He is now one of the giants inside the community. December was a, a bit rough, I'm not gonna lie, but guess what? It's 2021! I'm so excited! It's gonna be a great, great year! Just kidding. Because it's a new year, it's a new dream, and Dream decided, hey, everything I've done thus far has been going great. Besides the occasional exposed videos on me, I mean, those guys don't even matter anyways. I'm somehow always trending on Twitter, no matter what. My YouTube videos are getting a f ton of views. You know what I should do next? Music. What could go wrong? Dream started making music with his first song being Road Trip. Road Trip was mediocre at best. It wasn't something I would listen to on the daily, but it wasn't a terrible song. The issue more so came when he made a song called Mask. I'll let a single video just describe pretty much what everyone was feeling at the time. I wear a mask with a smile for hours at a time. Stare at the ceiling while I hold back what's on my mind. This song wasn't great, but considering I guess he's just a YouTuber, a Minecraft YouTuber that specializes in the algorithm in Minecraft, but not music, 
it was okay. Others saw this as the worst thing that was ever made. In fact, people seemed to enjoy the Sus remix more than the actual song. That's saying something. You've got mail. Remember when GeoSquare made a video on Dream, and he pretty much just said, Math, you're wrong, and then Dream responded saying, Math, you're wrong, and then they had this ginormous argument on Twitter? Well, guess what? Dream five months later admitted to cheating. Lol. After all that time, Dream came out on Twitter saying that he had to get something off of his chest, and said, Hey, I cheated. And then he linked a Bible, which I won't be getting into. But because the drama already went by, no one really cared, and they just supported Dream either way. This was probably partly because Dream didn't really care much about speedruns anymore, because he had Manhunt to fall back on. But he pretty much just admitted to having a mod type thing that increases chances of getting blaze rods or whatever. Fast forward a month, and guess what? You know how Dream made that great song called Mask, and everyone loved it? Well, he made a music video for it, which just pretty much furthered the hate. But this time, even the Dream stands are pissed off at him, because he decided to do the biggest sin alive. I just really wish that I could pass this. People didn't like Dream's music video because he dumped his normal pills in the animation, which are actually ADHD pills, and <laughs> pretty much Dream decided to dump those bad boys inside the drain. Because Twitter takes things a little too literally, a lot of people got mad at Dream for this. Another day, another drama. Dream's face was apparently revealed. So everyone was going crazy that they apparently found Dream's face. Except, it wasn't Dream's face. Pretty much, Twitter found this random dude and said, Hey, it's Dream. And for some reason, a bunch of people thought this was instantly real, even though there was no evidence really to prove that it was. And the picture was this handsome young Chad, but Twitter being Twitter, they decided to bully this kid because they thought he was Dream. Dream later said it wasn't him and said that they're just leaking some random person's face. And for some reason, people still to this day think that Dream is this dude, so... Yeah, this is Dream. You know how in 2020, there was a mob vote, and pretty much Dream decided to rig it? Well, 2021 decided to have a mob vote as well, and Dream decided that he was gonna rig it, but he didn't end up rigging it. The entire time, it was just one big joke, and Dream made that completely clear, but Twitter still wasn't able to accept that as a joke. They said, yo, Dream, that's not okay, which Dream just replied with, shut up. It's now present day, and Dream's not in any drama. There's a lot I've learned from Dream, and he's definitely a mystery. But for now, that's it. Are you hiding anything else from us, Dream?